I just want you to get into a place that's comfortable. And I just want you to close your eyes. And then start just taking a few deep breaths. And before we begin this process today, as usual, I want you to just envision a beautiful dome around you, which is going to provide you with a protection and is going to contain you in your own beautiful energy. Just going to remove some energy. I think one of you's got a headache. So you can also um, tap lightly on your head if you've got a headache, it just removes the energy. Also guys, it's really important this week, especially that you're keeping hydrated. And uh, that usually means uh, water, <laughs> not gin. Um, just a really, really good source of water, okay? This work does take a lot of extra energy within your body, okay? So I really want you to just take extra care of yourselves. And as always, we're going to call in our light team members. So we're calling in and setting the intention to bring in, either you can visualize or just request any light beings, any archangels, any cosmic beings, any spirit members, our team who are here to bring unconditional love and guide us on this journey, asking them to come in to our individual bubbles now, any rays of light, any elements, any fairies, any fae, any other beings that want to join us from the light only. Also, I want you to set one extra process today. So it's important that um, the other beings cannot see us doing this process. So I just want you to set the intention or visualize putting an invisibility cloak over your dome so you are undetected. And how I like to envision it if you're struggling is like, I almost like to pull like a carpet from the cosmos. So we're almost like a carpet of the stars, a black carpet with beautiful twinkly stars. And I just pull that over my, myself and around myself. And then I just literally become invisible. Beautiful. Oh, I can see one of you like really shining bright purple in your dome. That's gorgeous. Okay, awesome. So today, guys, we're going to be focusing on expanding your containers uh, in order that you can receive more abundance in your life. So when I talk about abundance, I'm not just talking about the numbers in your bank account. I'm talking about your ability to see yourself as the advanced, beautiful, grounded, amazing, intelligent, very, very capable being that you are. I want you to remember always that what you are desiring and what your biggest vision is in life, that you have already achieved this and you have already done this and you are already doing this on another timeline, on your own unique divine timeline. And so it's just a matter of you getting your, out of your own way and taking the action steps in order to bring those desires and that vision to you. That makes it easier, I think. <laughs> and so what I want you to do is I want you to envision yourself sitting in a beautiful cone, almost like a big uh, open cup. And you're at the very start of the cup and there's a really big open funnel. It's a really big, huge open funnel. And if you look around yourself, we all have our own funnels. We all have our own infinite funnels. 
where the universe is just waiting to fill them up when we just start taking the action points. So we are in our own beautiful individual funnels circling around the universe and we're in the cosmos. And the universe is there. And the universe is almost like the genie in the battle, except we can ask the universe for infinite number of wishes and its answer will always be yes, whatever it is that we ask. And so I want you to envision in, in the middle of us, and we're all in our little cones around the outside, is a huge vat of liquid molten gold. And it's not hot. It's not going to hurt you. It's just like the color of honey. It's so gorgeous and activating. And this is just pure, infinite abundance. So when we talk about abundance, this is just everything that makes you feel good about you and about being you and about living in this beautiful reality. And one by one, you're going to see that this huge vat of molten. This huge vat of molten gold like honey substance is going to fill up your funnel. And you're just there witnesses and receiving this beautiful infinite abundance from the universe. And I want you to just feel into your body how this feels for you. Do you feel like this is a beautiful thing to receive? Do you feel a bit worried? Do you feel like you're ready? And I want you to just observe what's coming up for you right now. And I wanna just remove the fears around receiving, around receiving anything, the fear that somehow it's going to change you for the worst, or somehow it's going to affect you negatively, or somehow it's going to be or cause extra stress or burdens in your life. Okay, so I'm going to set that intention and then I'm going to blast through this energy for each of you with light language. My guys want you to know that you are deserving of all of this abundance that is coming to you. All you have to do is be open to receive it. And then just ask what your next step is. That is all that the process is to do in the universe. It really is as simple as that. So the universe is just going to keep filling up your beautiful funnel. And as you see this beautiful funnel, there is no end. There is no end. It flows out of the bottom and it flows in the top. There is no end to this energy that you can receive. And if you look around you, everybody's funnels is the, are the same. You're not taking any energy from anybody else by receiving. No, it's not going to make you feel differently to how you feel right now. You are safe to receive in this moment and you are safe to receive in your life. And you are so deserving of everything that universe wants to bring to you. So I just want you to start visualizing this beautiful funnel being filled up, never ending and never flowing, never, never ending and never flowing, never stops flowing, just in and out. We have to be grateful for the outflow as well. And that's something that they want to remind you of, that when we have the outflow, when we are paying bills or when we have the capacity to pay people, we must also exude gratitude for that. 
because that is as important. I just want you to feel how it feels to have this ever never ending flow of abundance in your life and how it hasn't really changed you. It's just provided you with this inner peace and this inner calm that everything is going to be okay. And that is the feeling of having abundance. It doesn't mean to say that you have a million pounds in your bank or a million dollars. It doesn't mean to say that you have to have more than you have. It just means to say that you have that feeling inside you that you have enough right now for right now for whatever you need. And you can trust the universe that if you need anything and it's in alignment with you, it will bring it to you. This is all about perception. This is all about how you feel. And this is all about trusting yourself and the universe that everything is always working for you. I just want you to also bring in that little version of you as well. Maybe there's a scene in particular in your life where you witnessed your caregivers or your parents or maybe a sibling talking about money in a really negative way. And I want you to just view that at the moment on a, on a screen, like on a TV screen. There are no feelings that need to come up, no negative feelings. We're just viewing it. And I want you to just look at that. And I want you to just remember that people will always talk about their own pain and project it. But it doesn't mean to say that you need to take it on yourself. Yeah, if you go out into nature, you are surrounded by abundance. Flowers do not compare with each other. They don't say, oh, you're more prettier than me, so I'm not going to shine today. The sun doesn't get upset with the moon. The moon doesn't get upset with the sun. The trees never compete with each other. In actual fact, they're always helping each other. If a tree is dying or diseased, the other trees will literally back it up. And that is what we're doing here. We're creating just the most amazing communities of people coming together to support each other from all walks of life. And this is what you are doing here. So abundance really is about having any more. It's just saying I'm happy with who I am and what I have. And I just want to integrate this truth right now and asking the teams to come in and work with you beyond the third dimension in dream space if you are open to that and remind you just how enough you are if you are a parent and you are doubting why your children chose you and whether you're up to the job I want you to know that your children chose you before they came into their bodies they actually sat down and they chose you and the experiences of everything that they have with you so there's no one more qualified in this whole universe, in this whole lifetime, to be their parents than you. I wish, I wish we could just implant into your mind just how brilliant and beautiful and amazing and enough you are, because then if you had that implanted, you would achieve everything. So now I'm going to ask your teams to work with you above 3D to integrate that truth of how you are enough and you can desire everything like I said before all you need to do is you just need to take the action steps to bring in everything that is for you that is all one step at a time with ease and grace removing blocks pushing through the fear using your body as the tool clearing your energy it doesn't have to be hard we're not asking you to hustle we're asking you to work in flow. So I just want you to feel this molten honey coming into your body now. So I want to fill your body with this molten honey. So similar to how we did with the energy clearing process, this molten honey and gold is literally just abundant. So we're going to bring it into our bodies. 
and it's going to be activating any dormant DNA, any cells linked to you receiving more abundance. I'm going to ask your teams to come in and assist you with this process. And they're going to be removing anything that has been blocking you to receiving. And as we fill these bodies, our own bodies with molten honey, it just starts to feel warm inside. We feel like we've had a lovely hot cup of tea, of chocolate, anything that you drink that makes you feel really, really good. And we're removing all those fears around money. They're dissolving. They no longer have to stay with our, our physical or emotional bodies any longer. We're asking for all these updates, these act activations to be done with ease and grace. And we're asking for emotions to be safely re released. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I want you to just bring this molten honey further up your body now. And I want you to just feel the whole of your body. So it should be, you probably feel it right up to your neck. I want you to just keep filling it up right into your headspace. And this is the feeling of abundance. It just feels really, really grounded. And you feel connected. And you just know that you've got enough. So if you ever feel like you're panicking about finances or whether I've got too much or sometimes too much responsibility around money, you know, I've got this money and I don't know what to do with it. I'm worried about it. Then I want you to just come back to this safe space connect with your team and ask them to remind you of this feeling of the molten honey just feel your body yes 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 allow 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 just allow your body to be full and allow yourself to just lean back into this molten golden honey so as well as being in the funnel you're full of this beautiful abundance and you're also just floating on the top now you're weightless. You are no longer like a human body. You just become one with this abundance. And that is the feeling of being connected with the universe and everything that it wants to give to you. Just allowing any fears that come up just to sit side, asking your mind just to take a break for a minute. And asking your team to just dissolve anything that's coming up for clearing with ease and grace. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Also activating any abundance codes, 111888. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Just keep breathing. Beautiful. Just lie. Just enjoy. Peaceful. <laughs> yes, beautiful inner peace. It's so gorgeous when you have this feeling inside of you. So I want you to lock it in now. Integrate this into your body. This feeling of just being enough, having enough. This is the feeling that should be your go-to because you were deserving of it all. My team just want to remind you again of the fact that everything that you desire, everything that you've got visions of, everything that you dream about that you want to create in this world, it's already happening on another timeline. All you have to do is take those steps to bring it in, whatever those steps are for you. And tomorrow we'll be giving you the tool and giving you the action steps to take so you can find that information for yourself. We're going to be accessing our teams through our own physical body. And so once you've got this process integrated, you will always know what the next step to take is. You will no longer have to provide, rely on external validation or any kind of guidance. Beautiful. Oh, everyone's floating. I love it. 
Beautiful. So guys, I know you probably want to stay in this beautiful place, but we need to come back to our realities because there is work to do in this lifetime. You were all brought here on purpose to create the pathways to the new earth based on the frequency of unconditional love. And I know you probably at times have thought and compared yourself to other people who are further ahead than you. But in reality, we are just waiting for certain pillars to crumble and crash. And then the new pathways and you will rise. And that's all it is. It's just a matter of timing and taking the right steps. So they're asking you to just be a little bit more patient and just stick to the plan. <laughs> it's all coming. They promise you it is. So I'm going to bring you back now. So I want you to just start bringing your awareness back to your body now. I need to bring your soul back into your physical human body. And how I like to do this is I just like to move my body. So... I move my head from side to side, rock my body a little bit, wiggling my fingers and my toes. And then when you feel ready, when you're fully back in your body, just feel free to open your eyes. And then I always like to make sure that everyone's back. So when you're back, tell me you're back. Yay, back, back, back. Rain's back, Jacqueline's back, Michelle's back, Randa's back, Lisa's back. Beautiful. 